Everybody's got their tickets. Ah, Nelson, welcome aboard, dude. Thanks for becoming a Raptor Egg. Good to see you all back for some Park Attack. I couldn't stay away. I like this game too much. So as an FYI, this week I'm going to be streaming a little bit less to put a little bit more time into some videos. There's some big demos coming out this week. And uh, lots of new games to play. Because of E3, there's a hell of a lot of new games in demo. And a lot of new stuff announced, and a lot of stuff coming out. And this is kind of like the end of the year before... There's kind of like a dead season between like June and... Eh, really like June and like maybe like August, September. It's almost like three and a half, four months where there's not... There's a few games that come out, but it's kind of a dead zone for gaming. There's not too much coming out. Except for a lot of demos and some other games like that, so we'll see. Did I see anything I really liked from E3? Yeah, I actually wrote down quite a few things that I uh, thought were quite cool that I started to follow on Twitter. A lot of games were already games that I kind of already had my eye on before, and uh, they just had like confirmed release dates or you know like trailers saying, "Hey, this is coming out," and I'd already seen it like on YouTube and stuff. So it's good other people found out about it. But one of them is definitely a game called uh, Soup. Soup pot where you get to like make your own like like Filipino dishes and like Asian dishes and it's just literally like a cooking simulator that looks so fun but exclamation point schedule in chat you guys can definitely see what's coming up on the schedule yeah Battlefield looked good yeah they're all the big games I'm like interested in trying out Battlefield actually looked better than it ever did so it, it, it actually is one that I'll probably put on the channel I actually want to play that all right, well, welcome back to Park Attack. We're going to try to complete this scenario today. Uh, this is a part of the advent. What is it called? Taste of Adventure DLC. Uh, so the uh, research shows you. Whoa, whoa. whoa. Uh, anyway, uh, so as part of the DLC, let's see. It's called Taste of Adventure, and I'm also playing with the Booms and Blooms DLC. Uh, this is the Timber Creek campaign, and this one I've been like, actually, I saw Silverrod. Another like YouTuber who does a lot of Architect and Planet Coaster and City Skylines and stuff, building games essentially. He unlocked this scenario, and when I saw him play it, I was like, I gotta play this. And I found it, I was trying to find a way to like get around all the other campaign missions, and I couldn't do it. So I like secretly had been playing Architect in the background all up to this moment. Ah. <sighs> oh, by the way, uh, giveaway alert! Giveaway alert! I have some keys to give away after the stream, by the way, uh, for a game that you may have seen a video on earlier today. So remember, I'll be doing a mandatory giveaway no matter what. Even if we don't hit the member goal right now, which, by the way, you should all click or tap join. Going to be dropping a lot of keys for all of you in the Discord in a couple hours. All right, well, let's get growing. Let's get going. I got to I gotta go quick now uh, because I got I to gotta keep a schedule for all this stuff I plan to do. But this is the Timber Creek mission. And this is like the, let's see, the third campaign mission. Let's see. I did all the other ones just to get to this moment. Right. So, Taste of Adventure, I went through an area that looked like an Aztec temple, and then like a steampunk volcano, and then an area called Candyland, 
And now, boom. This is the scenario I've been waiting for. Let's go. Timber Creek, a very small plot of land nearby a rustic sawmill, provides a charming location for a roadside attraction. The landowner is willing to grant you more space, but only if you prove that you're able to put the land to good use by attracting a large number of guests. You can't charge any park entrance fee. So basically, the goal is to eventually, over time, go from 100 guests to 600, and eventually the map gets bigger and bigger, and we start next to a really small spot in a nice river. I like these challenges where like, you have to build a lot in a small space. It's really, really cool. Really, really cool stuff. All right. Well, let's get to it then. So we have this lovely space, Timber Creek, next to a sawmill. Ooh, look at that. A nice little water wheel. Oh, this is nice. Oh, yeah, there's the road that leads to the parking lot. I, I, I wish this game would do a little more in showing, like, buildings and parking lots and stuff. It would make it a little more realistic and believable. But okay. So we got to build an amusement park in this tiny space. And chat's got a tiny little bit of space until they get to 100 likes. It's not long now, so congratulations to everybody smashing that like button before we hit the big, the big 100. Thank you very much for all that support. And we're almost to a million, so welcome back to all those subscribers. All right, we're going to make ourselves a nice little food court here. Got to start with the food, food most important. It is all about the food, dude. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. All right, so yeah, this is definitely small. It's meant to be small, and then eventually it'll they'll uh, make it a little bigger as time goes on. Once we complete objectives, then we get a little bit more space. All right, let's try to build a. Hmm. Something like this, I'm gonna put some shops here. And then maybe like an eating area. A Lego build next? Oh, it's been a while since we've done a Lego build, that's for sure. I don't know, maybe in the future we'll get to something like that. Um, you're new here, where am I from? Um, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Okay, let's try some more building. We're making like a little food court. And then our pathway can go straight. I guess this will be our main path. Build the Lego Coliseum. Oh yeah, that'd, that'd be quite the undertaking, wouldn't it? Quite, quite the big job on that one. Okay, so we're going to build a food court here. Yeah, does everyone have their tickets? Yeah, all the members should have their VIP tickets. I hope so. We're going to make this park look really nice, by the way. I'm going to try to fill all the space. That's what's going to be cool about this one. You guys came to the right place. All you members are in the right spot. I want to build with this. Oh, yeah, I forget. We have, our, we have a super chat uh, message on, too, by the way. I think it's... I think it's in Australia now for any $5 plus super chats. Unknown Planet, thanks for the three. I don't even know if I've heard that voice. Okay. So we can build something down here. Let's figure out what we got for rides now. Carousel and a Ferris wheel. Ferris wheel will be cool here. Yeah, actually, even if we raised it up higher, it would be nice. That'd be kind of cool. I think we could put a waterfall under it. Or a river. That'd be nice. Bum, 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 bum. Let's see. I want to put something here for sure. Actually, this is really skinny, so we could try to fit this up here. But I like the idea of having it in the center of the park, so this is a good spot. So let's do it right here. Like, up one would be nice. Oh, 
But let's build it right there. Okay. Nice. We're gonna design some buildings too. Some like uh, this seems to have like a like a timber lodge, midwestern slash German kind of feel to it or something. So we'll we'll definitely be doing something like that for sure. Bum, 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 bum. All right, let's see what else we can do. We could paint this. Hmm. Actually, I would like to do bricks. And then like that. Yeah, that'll do. Well, that's nice and uh, organized. Yeah, we gotta put down more rides. Carousel's good, but I think we need more thrill rides, flat rides. Wipeout's a good one. Put that in a tight space right up here. This place is gonna be all about tight spaces, so it's gonna be really cool to see how we can fit it all in. You think we need a zipper in here? Yeah. I, I don't know if that's actually a ride in the game that we can build, but I, I agree with you. Name the game, exclamation point game. Let's see. Oh, I don't know if we can actually... Uh... Oh, yeah, we can. So we can't charge a park entrance either, so we're going to have to be careful. We're going to super detail everything. I kind of want to do this with our group. This is one thing we do, by the way. For those of you who like Park Architect and our members, uh, keep in mind we do multiplayer Park Architect quite often. And we plan to do some more like multiplayer uh, American Truck Simulator and Euro Truck. Some of these games are getting really good with their multiplayer. It's better for us to find something where it's like four, um, like eight plus players. We're gonna make something that looks like a nice sawmill here. We're gonna do something definitely nice with wood. Yeah, that'll look nice. Actually, we could do these on the edges. Yeah, I think that looks nice. It's going to be a, like our food court eating area. Okay. Oh, I love how small this is going to be. It reminds me of like a Dinky Park from the original... Roller Coaster Tycoon, that was really cool. Alright, we want to do a wall. Out of, uh... Like a... Some sort of a wood? Yeah, this will be perfect right here. Excellent. Exactly what I wanted. Bum, 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 bum. I forgot, what's the command for do you play, have you played? I forget that one. I forgot what that one was. Zombie, thanks for the 10, dude. Alright, we'll put one of these little trees over here. Oh, we need, we need to get this tree in. Been watching your Trader Life Sim videos. Just bought and tons of fun.
Ready for police sim to drop. Oh, thank you. Yeah, we'll be playing that probably not tomorrow, but uh, the seventeenth, I think. We'll see how that goes. Okay, we got to put an employee path back here with some of the shops we plan to build. Oh, that's perfect. Actually, we should make this employees only back here. Yeah, we could do that. I need to do a uh, employee... Uh, we need a little break room. Like a staff room at some point. What do we have for shops? Ah, uh, very German. We got bratwurst, pretzels. Too bad there's no beers. Hey, Amen, brother. Alright, let's go with the hot dog stand. Pretzels. Uh, turkey legs and ice cream. Oh, wait, do we have a drink? Wow, no drinks. We'll do ice cream. Nice. Then we should be able to extend this building a little bit. Oh, I see they went with the wood pattern too. Cool. We'll extend this building a little bit. And we'll need a pathway for fallers and stuff to get out of here. Yeah, I don't know what we'll do about the top. Nice, a little detailing here will look really nice. Now, since this park's a lot smaller, I'm going to go more detailed than we ever had before, so it's something actually interesting to look at. Although I haven't done anything to this uh, extent before. We'll try to make something nice. That balcony looks cool. these beams here. There we go. You want pizza rolls? You want the pizza roll stand? I completely understand. I think some people in chat are selling pizza rolls on the uh, pizza roll black market. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum. Oh, it looks like they went with adding, like, a white roof to the front. Okay. We'll try to do the same. Essentially, what we're doing here is we're just extending the already existing building. Nothing too complicated. Although this is way more complicated than I used to play this game. It was quite intimidating for a long time. Because it was new, and I I'd never done anything like this. So it feels good. The Nugget Cafe. Wow. Well, if anybody needs nuggets, chat's opening up the Nugget Cafe. This will look really nice. Okay, let's add some beams and then a window. Oh, it looks nice. It looks like it's all part of the same building here. It's convincing. I don't know how they got that little uh, window in there, though. Oh, I see how they did that. Well, I think they did a free placement on that to try to avoid the uh, beam in the middle.
I don't think we need windows, but it looks okay. And if it's off a little bit, that's okay too. YouTuber, when is the Fortnite stream? I can't believe Fortnite's still around. That's crazy. People are still playing that game. I can't believe it. Okay, let's do a little underhang. Oh, that looks cool. Did I put a support beam here? Oh yeah, we did. Then we need like a little uh, doorway here. Like this. Nice. I don't know how they got this window in like this though. Bum 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 bum. All right, let's add some more trees, maybe. Uh, I think we'll do trees last. I also kind of want to extend this area to the... You know what, actually? Instead of putting a window there, let's put a wall here. I think what I want to do is extend the... Oh, I see how they got the windows. It's, it's from the depot building. Okay. So those windows are probably not something you can put down. I want to make like a nice entrance here, like a nice little ticket booth, you know? So maybe something like this. Eh, I want to do something different on those edges. Well, eh, it's going to be hard to find the perfect piece for that one, but we can get close. Something in between each shop to fill the gap. Oh, yeah, you're right. We could put some support beams here. How do we feel about that? Yeah, it looks good. Then we'll put the railing up there. There's kind of this fence here. Maybe we can put it as trim. And that kind of gets cut off by the shop, but uh, that looks better. Yeah, that, that, that looks good. Good call, chat. Good call. Big brains. Chat's got them big brains. But well, they got that notification bell turned on and they never miss a live stream. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, they got big brains. Hmm. I'm going to build a building here. Maybe we can make a double tall building. I want to make this all look like it's connected. This is already, this is uh, my favorite park. Like, I love this so much. I love the, the limited space. Limited space and limited budget makes for good, very good creativity. You guys know if you've ever had to get creative at like a birthday party or something like that. If you've ever planned an event and there's a pretty tight budget, it makes for some of the best creativity. It makes things awesome. Actually, this could be a full wall. I'm using half walls, but I guess this will be easier just because it's already the right color. There we go. All right, let's try some roofing here. Ooh, this is going to be weird. Hmm. Oh, that's so cool how the building is all sorts of different heights. Not sure what I'll do in the middle. Hmm. 
Wow, look at all those dino nuggets. Chat's getting hungry. Well, it's lunchtime somewhere. That should be Raptor's uh, theme. Put the employees' lounge on the balcony. Uh, yes. Although, we'd have to figure out a way to get our employees up there. We'd have to build a stairwell. I don't know if we have enough space for that, but I, I like that idea a lot. Like, we could actually put this employee room, like, up here or something. We could try. Or we could put it somewhere else. It might... The, the space might be a little tight, but that is a good idea. That would be cool if we can fit that in. Verticality? I'm all about that. That's cool. That's yet another big brain idea. Uh, rotate the roof 90 degrees and it'll fit perfectly. You mean these ones here? Oh, I see what you mean. You mean like putting the roof like this? Ooh, I don't know if that'll work. Oh, you know what? That looks freaking awesome. That's like a gate. Chat? Chat, what's going on? You're being extra big brain today. I like it. We're working together. Dude. I don't think I can put beams here. I don't know why. I think it's just too close to the edge of the uh, the boundary. Let's see what the problem is. Yeah, it's a high mine. True. Oh, yeah, okay. So it looks like we're building on the outside. I need to build on the inside. I think we got to rotate these pieces to be on the inside. Yeah, you're doing good today. The uh, big brain hive mind to chat. I, If I were you, I think I'd become a member because, like, you know, resistance is kind of futile when it comes to uh, joining and whatnot. Being a chat, hive mind chatter. One of us. One of us. Okay, so that's going to be glitchy if we... I should be able to do this, though. Yeah, that works. There's some like glitchiness to this game where things will like flash and like layering will be a problem, but it's not that big of a deal in this section. Especially like we're not gonna really see the entrance, but we may as well try to put more time into it than we ever did. Also, I could put something on the inside. What could we put in there? An info booth? Oh, we could put an info Oh wait, actually wait, 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 wait. Let's do this. Perfect. We'll put the info booth right in the middle. Oh, bro. That's a genius idea. And then there's like two little sections there. We'll paint the tiling. Okay, let's move the info booth inside. Bro, we're going to fit so much stuff in a small location. I'm so excited for this. This is going to be so cool. Like, I can't wait to, like, hit the go button. You know what I mean? And, like, open the park. Alright, so we've got that. Okay, this is going to look a lot better. Right now, it's, you know, this is just prototyping. Luckily, we get all the money back from toying around with stuff, too. Like, there's no real punishment for doing it. Wait, then let's use these beams. These beams are like a good theme here. The beam theme. Oops. Nice. That kind of fits. Okay, what can we put inside? Like some benches? Let's get a bench that really like... Oh, I like this one. That'll be the bench we go with. And that's a nice open area to the park. Dude. 
Dude, the beam theme in your dreams? Oh man, I I I hope to be that one day? Question mark. Okay, well, I guess we all have dreams. Oh, we could put some vending machine. Oh, actually, the, the the weird thing about vending machines is they kind of like take up a whole, like a whole spot, like a whole square. You can't just like tuck them up against a wall, which is a little, it's a little annoying, but it's not not a big deal. Okay, so let's try to make a uh, little trimming here. Uh oh, Jerry's back, y'all. Hey, Jerry, how's it going, pal? What's going on in Jerry's world? I like this tower. It's like the, this gate here is a little taller than this building just by a little bit. You can tell, but it doesn't look like it. Just very little. Jerry spent many hours to be big brain in this game so he could maybe play with the team someday. Ooh. Yes, Jerry. Yes, come come play Parkitect with us when we do multiplayer sometime. I always end up coming back to this game as just like a guilty pleasure. And I'm happy to do it because it's just... It's such a great game for creativity. And it, the best thing is to see how creative our community is. Like, we, we've got some pretty big brains in chat. And there's some people who just like come up with ideas that you... Well, I've seen you guys play The Sims. I'm pretty impressed with what everybody does sometimes. Okay. Did I do this this way or this way? No. I need a few little pieces on the corners. This may seem like really over-the-top detailing, but I honestly think that since this park is so small, this is one of the very few parks that I'd like to try to detail as much as possible just because the size is not, not a big park. So, like, you'll be able to really tell the difference from a distance. off a little bit. Okay. Ah, this is going to be a pain in the corner. Now ah, we'll just have to get it close. I can't use the alt to snap in these corners because it's too close to the edge of the like the property line for the park, so it's not going to cooperate. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. The white tile, please. White tile. What you talking about? Oh, dude, this is going to be cool. Okay, we're almost done, then we can go back to rides. The biggest challenge here is going to have to be building a coaster. When we get to building coasters, it's going to be crazy. Now we need to do trim around here. 
You want me to do a giant mega coaster? Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, that's cool. We can put a window there. Ah, Kotono from Denmark. Aw, thank you very much. I love Denmark. I gotta go back. My Danish friend has been quite busy, and of course, the last year hasn't been easy either, so... Maybe one day I'll go back to Copenhagen or wherever. Go check on the gang. Thank you very much for the support. Love from Denmark. Thank you. That was a very interesting uh, Danish accent you have. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and call this good. We'll, we'll detail later when we get some more ideas. But honestly, that's... Wow. That's about as good as it's going to get for me, I think. Can we do any sort of detailing on some of this stuff here? It makes all the difference, though. Like, if, if you take some time and it seems a little boring, the payoff can be big. Because you often don't... Some of the missions you're not allowed to pause in, so you don't always take the time to do that. But today's the day. Today's our detailing day. Oh, wow, that looks nice. We're going to even do fireworks here, too. You did a spy theme party for your daughter? Oh, that's cool. That's actually really cool. Did everyone, like, end up in, like, some sort of a shootout at the end and have to escape in a high-speed chase or something? That's how those spy movies always end. No, just that one tile? I don't... What? What about the tile? I... There's so many tiles. <laughs> Which one? What do you want me to do to what tile? Tell me more. Oh, we can paint the entrance. Cool. Okay, all done. Are you talking about the the wall tiles? Or are you talking about the, the cobblestone? It's okay you fix it now? Oh, you're talking about me painting it. Oh. Oh, yes. Well, in these types of games, we're never done. So you're right, we we needed to finish that one up. Alright, let's do a nice little wall here. Let's do a brick wall. Let's see, a little brick wall. Just a tiny little, just a happy little wall. Just a happy little brick wall. Uh, let's do something, ooh, that's nice. The wall lamps are cool. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. Cool. I hope these actually light up. Yeah, we need a happy little Bob Ross wall in chat, too. Maybe we could go with this regular wooden wall. I, I do like the idea of using lots of timber because it is a sawmill after all. I like that idea. And then we can put some happy little benches in there. For everybody to sit down and enjoy. Little seating area for the food court, basically. Oh wow, this is this is this is great. This is this is amazing. This is really cool. No, I haven't played that bonus, but whatever I do plan to play is on that schedule. I'm looking forward to all the games coming up. This there, there's there. Honestly, let's be honest. There, there's just way too many games. There are way too many games now. It's not a bad thing either. There's just too many. That's the problem. There's too too many good things. 
What's up, Harry? How you doing, man? Welcome to the big stream. Oh, this is going to look really nice. We're also going to take some time to name our rides, too. We're going we're gonna to put the most amount of effort we've ever put into this park. And it's going to look nice. And the more time we spend detailing it and stuff, too, the higher the rating will be. And the higher the rating, the more customers that will show up. That'll actually help us accomplish our goals faster. I hope. Name one after the next member to join. Well, we'd have to get somebody to click or tap that join button, but we could try to come up with a we could try to come up with a funny way to, to name it so it sounds like a member's name. All right, let's paint this pathway. Well, that's weird. Ah, we'll change the colors of the rides too. We're gonna put a lot of care into this. It's gonna look awesome. This already looks amazing. We gotta put a ride up here. The rides we have are a little big, though, for this limited space. It's very tiny, but the goal of this one is once we get 100 people in the park, boom, it's going to expand even more, and it's going to be good stuff. Oh, Scott, tomorrow's the big day? Big day for Scott. Let's get some Pinto Bless in chat. It's a big day. Hey, we need to put a toilet down. Oh, I got an idea. We'll put it over here. And we'll use my favorite fence for it. I love this thing. I get my new Linksies wireless gaming router tomorrow. Yay! Oh, good for you, man. Pinto Bless. The nice thing about the bathroom... I've been making these, like, little like pods for the bathroom and the cool thing about this is one it hides the bathroom and two it gives you extra space to put uh, trash cans and stuff in there you can actually like have like a little pit stop for a uh, bathroom and also a uh, like a little uh, tr area for trash which is important let's do a trash bin I like this square one Paul, thank you very much for becoming a raptor egg. Welcome aboard. We need some trash cans here, too. And we're going to have to put something out here. Maybe we'll put a garden or something here. That'll look nice. Paul, enjoy your new emotes. Thanks for smashing that join button. we got to come up with a... We had to come up with a name for one of these rides for Paul. Not a Ferris wheel anymore, it's a Paulus wheel. Congratulations, Paul. And since you're a new member, that means you're green. So let's do like a cool... Let's do a cool green color. We'll make the supports like a gray color. The outer wheel can be green. Oh, nice. Oh, that'll look cool. Like a giant flower. about red too Christmassy and let's do white maybe a blue color Well, that certainly sticks out. That's a good one. Let's go with that. 
Ah, oh, it sticks out nicely. What does it look like at night? I think we gotta proceed time forward to see that, but that's okay. Alright, so now... We gotta put down some more rides, don't we? We need, uh, boy, what accommodates the most people. Top scan's pretty good. What's the... Medium, medium. Low, medium. Medium, medium, low. Uh, the thing is, some of these rides are low. But we gotta find rides that take up a very small space. So it's like we're gonna have to build all these rides because it's all we got at the start. We could put this down by the water. Ooh, the top scan's cool. Oh, there. We should put that over the river somehow. Oh, yes, we'll build like a little overhang. Nice. Yeah, that'll overhang the river a little bit. I'd love to put some boats down here. You know what we really need is a log flume. This is kind of an old lo uh, lumber mill, so that would be appropriate. Yeah, we got to change some of the ground here. we got to terraform a little bit. change the colors on this thing too. That's a good one though. Good fit. Alright, we need... Let's see, we got a Ferris wheel. Car uh, Carousel is going to take up a bit of space. I feel like we need to fit every one of these rides though. We also need a coaster, but I don't know if I want to start with one right at the beginning. We could put a ride up here though. We got we to gotta use all the space. We got to use it. We gotta use all the space here. Okay, let's try to put in some cool half walls here. Well, I guess here we can just double up. There we go. There we go. That's going to look really cool. There's like no supports on this side though. make a little barrier there so that way our people don't like walk over the edge that's a that's what you call an insurance liability kids all right that looks cool but now the goal is to get everybody down we could build like a nice little queue up here this Ooh Oh actually this is a queue isn't it? Got to switch back to this. Yep. Oh, that's going to look really neat. Last thing we need is a lawsuit, I know. Or maybe it's the first thing we need. 
Maybe we should get it out of the way early. Okay, that looks pretty cool. We'll make sure that's opened. Okay, we need more ride names soon. Wow, we fit a lot in here already. This is nice. Okay, we need... We need a staff room. Staff room. We could put a staff room over here. Oh. Yeah, we could we could hide our staff room here next to the restrooms. Hmm. Yeah, that might be nice. And the day after that. I really do like all these wood trims here. Snack attack? Is someone having a, a snack attack in chat? Don't worry, you guys got plenty of popcorn. If anybody wants popcorn, you do you do get free popcorn for becoming a member. It's all it's all part of our new promotional program. Popcorn for members. Member members, you get popcorn. Okay. Oh, we could put some nice little flower pots here or something. Well, we should put something underneath this uh, this booth here. Maybe make it, uh, yeah, like stone or something. There we go, dude. We filled we filled in so much space now. This is great. I guess we, all we just got to make sure we're profitable now. Their pants we're going to wear tomorrow. And the Monorail coaster. Oh, we're not going to have a lot of room for that. I I really think we got to start with small rides first. Do we fit one here? No, I don't think there's anything we can fit there. But we could try to put some more services here. Oh yeah, like a cash machine. Or vending machines, or balloons. Oh yeah, we could put we could put shops in a few different spots, yep. Employee area will be over there. And we'll kind of like separate that too. Yeah, we don't we don't want profits going down. We want to go up, up, up. Ooh, that looks cool. Wow. Hey, that turned out nice. I'm really impressed with what we got so far. Good job, Chad. You've done a great job. You're doing all the work. Alright, so we can put a little walkway underneath the uh, Ferris wheel. This provides a wonderful long area for a roller coaster, possibly. Definitely a chance to put something there. Dude, very impressed. What's up, Hubert? How you doing, dude? Welcome. What a nice tree here. I wonder if we can try to put something here. Now that kind of is a little too different. Hmm... Oh, we, need, we do need to put something down here, though. I'm going to go with... I'm actually going to go with one of these. I'm going to put, like, a... Maybe, like, a concrete or cement thing here. Maybe something like this. Just closed up the restaurant for the stream. Oh, nice. Well, I'm glad to have you here. Welcome aboard to all the new subscribers and everyone hanging out. Hope you're all having a nice week so far. What if we do that? That looks cool. Oh, 
Oh, we could put a vending machine here. Yeah, what if we put a vending machine there? We also need to put some more benches down. Especially at these ride exits. There we go. Vortex back as a raptor egg again. Welcome back, Vortex. Nice to have you with us. We'll leave some of these pathways open. It's a little cr a little crowded here. But obviously we can't have too many multiple wide paths because a lot of this has to go towards rides or decorations to get our rating up. we got to get our numbers up. Right now we're at rookie, rookie numbers. New member, welcome. Wow, welcome. Yeah, I want to add some more angles here. We'll put some plants in there. Oh, this is going to turn out amazing, guys. This is going to be one of the coolest th uh, theme parks I think I've ever made. Well, I love this campaign. It's really challenged me. Planet Coaster does a lot of good stuff, too. It's really not like a good or a bad game between the two or a better. They're just both good. Like, real good. Cool. Alright, let's see. Bum, 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 bum. Members get a parking spot? Well, there's a road to your uh, park. This this road actually leads to uh, Planet Coaster where Uthras made a Planet parking lot. I would like to actually see them make a Planet parking lot. Uthris makes parking lots and parking garages and stuff in that game. That's crazy. All right, let's add uh, a couple of trees. I do like adding some of these trees. All right, I want to put flowers in the flower bed. Oh, you know what? Actually, we could do this. Oh, that's cool. That makes an interesting angle to that. All right, let's do some flowers and stuff. What do we got? Ooh, we could just do some... Oh, I like that. Basic scrubs. Let's put some scrubbies in there. Oh, that looks nice. Okay. And we can put some ivy on some of the walls if we want. Wait. Let's see if this will fit. Uh, I, I think the sign might be a little too long. Let's try something else. Yeah, I think that was a little too long. Let's try, uh... Well, let's just try that. That that might be good. Yeah, that's, that's better. I think that's better. Let's see. I guess you have to place it ahead of time? Oh, I, yeah, I guess you should type it out first.
I wish I could nudge it down just a little bit. Well, that looks cool. You know what else is cool is they have a bathroom assigned to. All the detailing you can do in this game is cool. There's lots of little things you can do. Okay, that looks nice. Timber Creek, isn't that wonderful? So it sounds like an old like sausage brand. Here at Timber Creek, we start with 100% pure timber. With a little bit of creek. Alright, that looks good. Okay, so now... We should probably build a path here so our employees can get out. I need something to hide those. Probably like a doorway. I could try to put a doorway like this here. But that might look a little strange with the uh, ride there. Where's the parking lot? <laughs> it's in Uthrisburg. You gotta go all the way to Uthrisburg. Or Al Allentown, I think is he. It's his official town name. When he, whenever he builds a city. Yeah, Uthrisburg ha uh, All Uthris does is whenever the parking lot's full, he just. They're, they're literally always building another level. Like, there is no top to Uthris' parking garage. It's always just... He always tops himself with yet another level. Well, that looks cool. That's a nice blend right there. That's like a coffee. What a nice blend. I wonder what we could put up here. Ah, eh, probably nothing. We'll block it off with a wall. Oh, but that pallet's in the way. Three... You're saving up for a vacation to go to Uthrisburg? Ooh, wow. You know, if you go to Uthrisburg, you don't get to come back. It's the same as clicking and tapping join and becoming a member right now. Like, once you become a member, you can't not ever be a member again. Or wait, is that a double negative? No, just join, please. I need it. I need attention, please. Uh, you're failing to find a spot to park. How are you supposed to get in? That's that's the ride. Uth Uthris' amusement park is trying to find parking at at Uthrisburg. Well, this actually would be a nicer tree to put in. Oh, it's a little, a little thick, though. But we'll try to keep our current tree. All right, I, fa I love the fact that we fit so many trees in here. I guess the goal is going to try to be to make sure every block's got something on it. No open spaces. Like there's a little open space there, but that's okay. It's like overhang by the tree. Man, this is cool. It would be cool if we somehow made a bridge up here to go over there, but we don't have enough space. Okay, that looks cool. Wait. Try that out. Always have to ruin things with a uh, corporate sponsorship. <laughs> there you go. Yes, Timber Creek is owned and operated by uh, Uthco, which is also a division of NASA. This isn't open TTD, though. That's true. We still have to play that now that that's like on Steam. It's so much easier for people to get into. Except for your girlfriend, she's not allowed to play for unrelated reasons and totally not because she's super good at the game and kicks our butts every time. Uh, let's do a wait. What's that thing called? A pavilion? No, is it? Oh yeah, it is pavilion. Oh, 
Well, that's cool. You've already informed her? Yeah. Well, she should know. Well, wait a minute. What do you mean you informed her? Shouldn't our attorney have issued her the, the restraining order on joining us in the in the game? She's too good. She's too good at that game. The, the, the gamer ladies of our community are, and, and the, the mutual people we know are very good at games. Suspiciously good. Too good. Okay. Um, so there's space here for something. The, the, once we hit 100 people in this park, it will expand. So there is possibility that we could add some more stuff here. I guess it would, it would be nice to know which direction it was going to expand before it did. But we can only base our decisions off what we know now. So there is potential for us to like add go-karts at some point. But I don't think there's any... Well, there's a spot for a ride here. Oh, it's getting too cluttered, though. Could do one over the river, but I don't really want to do that. <laughs> miniature railway. It better be like one, one seven hundredth scale of a miniature railway if it's going to fit in here. Oh, the log flume. It is my goal to try to put a log flume and a monorail coaster in here. Or a mini coaster. I wonder what we could do. Mini coaster? Maybe we, maybe we could try a mini coaster. Alright, there's too much open space. What else could we add? We got a staff room, bathroom. We could add a bunch of little detail. Each little detail it will bring in uh, more customers. Well, that's nice. Staff bathroom? Um, I don't think you... I, I think a bathroom is just a bathroom. Anyone can use it. I don't know if you can differentiate between the two. Well, that kind of looks cool. Fill that space, baby. Also, I want to put lights down so it looks nice at nighttime. I think we'll go with these modern lamps. Or maybe we should use these ones. Now yeah, this looks more like a mining thing. Let's go with these nice ones. Hmm. Cringe. Open the park? Oh, we will when she's ready. I think we should have more detail, though, because if I do that, it'll bring our rating up, and that'll bring in more people. We can only get more space when we have a... Uh, current population or total number of guests of a hundred. If we get a hundred guests, then it'll expand it, and that'll allow us to build coasters, and that's really what we need to do. But I want I want to open it. Okay, what else can we build? So we did most of the rides. I really want to fit one more ride in. We could do it here. Let's do some research as well. We should probably be researching, yeah, definitely thrill rides. And quickly, too. All right, we can try to fit in some more shops. That'll be good. They won't have delivery from the back, but that's okay. We could put some shops here. We have uh, cookies and balloons. That'll work. Cookies, yep. Alright, we pretty much got everything down. That's nice.
Yeah, we could cut this section off to fit another ride in there if we want to. I think deliveries, if you don't have a access to the back of the building, I think haulers can still deliver from the front. We'll just let them hand it over. Okay, let's paint this stone. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, this will be a good fit. Plus, some of the lines need uh, decoration, too. That'll bring their rating up a little bit if you put, like, a just even a simple awning or something over them. Actually, isn't there a... There's a really cool... I think it's under archways. Yeah. This thing is really cool. What's up, Lance? How you doing? Well, that kind of looks nice. A lot of this is going to be a crowded spot, but it'll work. Wow. Anime intro. Let's see. Archways. Anger. Oh yeah, we can put umbrellas down too. Some things are just going to overlap. Uh, this is just uh, Pretzel. That's the name of like the, the music website. It's like ro royalty-free music that actually works. Oh, boy. We're going to put something in the middle. Well, if we get a motion, like if we get a uh, like a 3D ride, like a, what do you call what do you call it, motion simulator or whatever, we can put one of those there. Not entirely happy with this. Maybe we can mount this here. Well, that looks cool. That sounds an angry. Fountain in the middle. That that would work. Could do a fountain. Yeah, I want to do a pavilion one at some point. Yeah, this is probably shaping up to be one of my uh, most detailed things ever. I think we should put a building here. Just got done downloading Gold Rush and Stranded Deep on your PS4. Awesome, dude. 
We gotta hear that Australian accent, though. I gave away some keys for Gold Rush on our uh, Discord for the PS4 version. If you guys haven't jumped on that Discord yet, make sure you do. I'm doing a key giveaway at the end of the stream, by the way, for... Just got done downloading Gold Rush and games you might like. deep on my PS4. Cool. Oh, this is a 3x3 square, isn't it? Mm. Well, actually, what we could do... Seven five. There we go. Let's kind of mimic one of these other buildings and make it all fit. Okay, time for some pillars. The music reminds you of Pokemon. Oh, boy. Wait, is that in the corner? Yep. away from opening the park, but we're getting there. We're just going to raise the ceiling up a little bit, I think. Oh, that'll look cool. I'm inspiring your online shopping right now. Oh, at Gordon. Gordon... Gordon is inspirational, isn't he? Certainly so. That's why we got the golden number one community. They all brought their tickets to the stream, too. Has everyone else got their tickets? Otherwise, it's not a big deal. Susan will just, it's just a small fine of like six, six or seven million dollars, I think, for not displaying your ticket in chat. It's a small price to pay. Oh, yeah, members got their tickets. Okay, that's good. looks nice. I think it's a little too small to put any sort of diagonal pieces on, but it might work. Well, actually, we'll have to put some uh, white triangles on the sides. It's 
<laughs> are we putting air conditioning near the rides? Well, there are options for that. That's a good point. You, you can put AC like on top of buildings. It doesn't change anything. Like it's just aesthetics. There's no like temperature control in the game, but that's cool that you can do. Well, that makes it a little more interesting than a basic uh, little queue. Nice. And then when people are done, they just step out over there. That's cool. Bum, 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 bum. I'll do another pavilion there. Paint that ride too. Bum, bum, bum. All right, so we'll save this for a like a motion thingy or some small ride if we can find one. If we can get a small ride, we'll put it right there. In the meantime, we'll put a. Uh, Little thing there. Cool. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, nice. All right, so we got to fill in something here and the space over here, we can fit something in now too. And then if we research a better ride, we can just delete it and switch it out because they're usually the same size. So actually what we can do is cut the corner out here. And fit it in perfectly right in the side. Patrons say my theme park is dirty. There's nobody here! Wait, is this song called Pinto Bless the Song? May he be blessed. Dude, we're fitting so many things in, it's awesome. Uh-oh. A very small queue. Wait, I cut that one off. Oops. Um, well, that actually kind of works. Ooh, I do not like that. That looks better. Okay. Lots of space here for all sorts of stuff. It's amazing how, like, it's such a small park, you realize, like, how much space you actually have to work with. It's kind of, like, confusing. You look at this and you're like, wait, there's tons of space here. This seems to be small, but nope. Crazy amount of space. We can put a light on the wall here. Now uh, we can hang a light over the over the corner. Brahmin, thanks for the twenty, dude. Thank you very much for your support. Thank you for all your content, Raptor. 
Uh, thank you, my Australian friend. Appreciate the support. It's like a remix of the Mass Effect, like, briefing song. Cool. Dude, we, we've, we're going to fit so much stuff in here, that's going to be awesome. Yeah, let's plant some trees back. That's nice. Maybe we could do an overhang over here. I kind of don't like this awning. But I don't I don't know if building a giant building there would be appropriate either. Maybe here? Yeah, that's nicer. Do another bush there and here. Boys, I think we're about ready to open. It's getting real full. Uh, we could put another ride here, but I think we could just save this for future space when the park actually opens up. We could try a double, double wide thing here. We eventually have to get 600 guests. That's pretty substantial for a park. It's going to be pretty small. We may need to do another food court somewhere too. Yeah, we could we could do more of these little pavilions there. In some sections. Like we can add those too. Not going to be perfectly covered from the rain, but... I can, we, we can repaint these too if we want. That looks nice. All right, we gotta we gotta get some more uh, members in here. We gotta name some rides. We gotta paint some rides. The colors are okay. They're honestly not great, but uh, we'll have to figure that out later. We at least have to paint this one. Let's do red and orange and uh, maybe purple. Oh, actually, red, red and yellow. No, red and white would look nice. All right, we'll go with that. All right, I think we're about ready to open this park. Chat, when we get to 300 likes, we will open the park. i got to wait for chat to authorize. i got to get the, the permit from chat. You guys smash that like button. We'll open up the park. About ready to open here. In the meantime, let's do some more detailing. It looks good. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, we're almost to that million subs as well. Thanks again, everybody, for subbing and hanging out with the channel. We are we are almost there, folks. We're almost ready to open. We're almost to the million. 
almost there everywhere. Crazy. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, I think we're ready to open. I'm trying to think of if there's anything else. We have, how many rides did we build? We built five. Not bad. And then we need to build a coaster, so we'll save this space down here for the coaster. I'm hoping that space across the river opens up. That way we could go down and back up. That'll make it easier. Lots of open space there. And plenty of space for a ride here. But I think for now, let's just put a pathway there. Like a temporary... Temporary walkway there. Nice. Let's try putting some fences down. I want to do something like this, yeah. Like a little steel fence. Yeah, that's nice. Keep everybody on the pathway for now. Wow, I'm really impressed with what we did so far, everybody. Good job, chat. You helped. Feel good. So many of you were giving good, damn good suggestions. We can even light up our little sign over here if we want to. We're going to attach lights to the banner. Cool. <laughs> that looks awesome. I love it. Now, we don't really have a pathway here, but sometimes they just got to be outdoors. Bum, bum, bum. You think it looks amazing? Oh, good. Well, it's amazing, like chat. This this was inspired by Bob Ross. This is Division of Bob Ross. Okay, anything else we should do? We could do more, more planting, more trees and stuff, but I, I think we're pretty good. Oh, maybe more trash cans. Just a couple more, because you know people. You know people. Especially over by the vending machine, maybe. Then we'll have to hire some staff members. Bob Ross would be proud, yeah. As you guys know, he was probably the, the founding father of, like, large amusement parks. He would find this place amusing. Let's see if we can fit one trash can over on this path. There we go. Okay, well let's put something here to fill in the space in the meantime. Maybe some shrubs just to just to get something in. Uh yeah, something like that. Do a couple of thingies like that. Let's put in a maple tree. I do want to do one maple. There we go. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. Okay, we need to hire staff and then we'll open the park. Let's hire... Like five janitors. This place is small, so we don't really have to assign zones. And then we'll hire a few haulers. We'll do five as well. Do two mechanics. Three security. And then we'll hire myself and me. And we'll hire one of myself and maybe a me. Good job, myself. I got the job. Well, thanks, myself. You're welcome. I think we are good to go. Let's go ahead and save this one at the start because that is freaking beautiful i am so proud chat so proud let's see what it looks like at nighttime. oh man 
All right, let's decorate this park at night. You guys are here for the grand opening night. It's opening night. Beautiful. Man, how cool is that? Okay, we gotta add some more lighting. Fireworks? Yeah, we could do a fireworks show. I, I like the idea of that. I'm gonna try to put some lights at the exits. We're preparing for liability insurance. <laughs> We're putting down lighting wherever we can. This looks amazing. Can't put lights everywhere, but it's pretty close. And some dark areas are nice, too. Alright, let's do a... Um, We're going to do some lights over here. Check this out. Why not flights? Lights. Now that's what makes all the difference right there. Ooh, look at that. Goes up over the top. That's cool. Oh, man. That looks great. I like that a lot. All right, now we're just waiting for the uh, park to fill up with people. All right, now we got to worry about pricing, so let's do like six bucks. We got to really charge too much, really, because we can't charge an entry fee for the park. So we got to make it up by the rides. Six bucks, four bucks, six bucks, five bucks, five bucks. That seems about right. Come on, let's make it daytime. Woo! Instead of funnel cakes, why not call them fun cakes? That's true. Oh no, recent negative reviews decrease the interest in the theme parks. There's a little thing behind. Charge for the bathrooms? Oh, wow, we can. I'm not that evil, though. I'm not that evil. This company is not run by EA. Oh, we could actually put a bench up here if we want. But that's fine. All right, so goal number one is to get to 100 guests, and then the park will expand a little bit.
The nighttime is really nice. Really nice. Chad, you're really nice, too. You're on your way to 400 likes. Good luck to everybody smashing the like before we get to the big 400. And congratulations to everybody who uh, subscribed before we hit the 1 million subs. That's awesome. Bum, bum. Vending machines are nicely stocked. Food court by the river. I like that idea. It's not too far from our already existing food court, though. And this will be perfect. I I'm going to try to put a roller coaster here because we don't, we don't really have a lot of room for a roller coaster, so I'm just holding on to it. Look at all the people in the park. This is great. I love this nice little space like this. We've completed a goal. All right. Oh, and look at that. Territory has unlocked, ladies and gentlemen. Phase one is complete. All right, we have $5,000 to build a coaster with. So we could build like a coaster up here. We could build a pathway here and then a station. We could build that monorail coaster. Boys and ladies, oh boy. I think we should, I really want to do the, the mini coaster though. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, I, I don't know if I want to do the mini or the monorail. We could do both, though. Let's start with the mini. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, chat with the exclamation point game. Good job, chat. Good job, chat. Yeah. Oh, this is going to be nice. We'll do a little hill. I think we can actually circle back on this. Too high for supports. Oh, wow. It can't go over like four. Ooh. This coaster is going to be difficult to deal with. Oh, boy. Get a, we need to get a lot of speed going here. Not a lot of options though for these tracks. This is going to make it near impossible to actually make a coaster for this one. We're going to have to tuck this one into the corner because otherwise not much we can do. do like a oh yeah what if we do that oh it's too close to the supports oh man what if we go the other way oh it's too too high for the supports no matter what way we go okay this coaster is going to be a pain in the neck it's very limited on how high it can go. Very limited. Let's try the monorail then. Or we could do a spinning coaster. Hmm. That's one I didn't count on. Yeah, the spinning coaster will probably be a better idea here. It can go a little higher.
Oh, we can also do an elevator. Ooh. Might be kind of weird. Hmm. There's, a, there's so many options in this small park. I love it. Let's try to build it over here. I wonder if the elevator will work as a block section, allowing for another train car. This means the cars have to be a lot smaller. Oh yeah, we can change the height too. Oh wow. Wow, that's cool. Oh, wow. Oh, we got a coaster. This is going to be interesting. That seemed to change the angle a little bit there. There we go. I am having so much fun right now, chat. This is just awesome, dude. I, I love this so much. I love this so much. I'm having, chat, what you call a good time right now. One's in chat if you're also having a good time. I better not see any zeros or twos. Remember, this is the mandatory fun zone. The mandatory fun zone, chat. Damn, look at that thing go. Woo! We could probably put some brakes in there. That's going to be pretty pretty substantial, I think. Mom, 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 mom. Are you feeling a little unwell? Don't worry about it, Falknot. My job to make sure you're all having a good time. It's like Disney World. If you guys aren't having a good time, then that means that you're all going to go to that secret prison. Underneath. That's how it works. Okay, next thing we need to do is add some more cars. Round spinning car. Ooh. Wait, cars per train too, but only one train. Oh, but we should be able to add multiple trains, though. Once we put in some block sections. We're going to try to keep this on this peninsula here. I really would like to build stuff below this... Uh, below this track like a little pathway or something coming down here or wh ooh, what if we put a ride in the middle we could put like a ride here and here That'd be sweet that's gonna go a little far but Hey man, brother. Good. I'm, I'm glad we agree. Chat, chat's very smart. 
for agreeing with me. That's too close underneath. just finished moving oh very nice I hardly move I never get out of this chair <laughs> moving is too dangerous oh we like execute like a very huge right turn I need to see how the I need to see how the game responds to these turns It stopped like running the test, so I need to make sure it does it. There we go. I need that blue thing to be up there so I can see. Ooh, that car's zipping along still pretty good. Need to do a left turn at some point. Too much, too much right turn going on. I'm gonna turn to the left at some point. There we go. That'll do. Yeah, this coaster is going to be real popular. Well, the problem is I can't really... Got to give myself a little space here. Give this a test. Our fir first coaster here. Oh man. You're wondering why this is labeled as absolute best? Did you not read the title in its entirety? Uh oh. Oh, it's not going to get up there, is it? No, no, no. No, oh, it's so close. It's so close. Well, wait, wait, wait. We could fix that by just reducing this to 20. Or actually, let's go 30. Or no need to trim. This music's cool. I agree. It's good times. All right, let's give this another test. If we, uh, if we speed it up, it should be better. Oh, look at that. We can operate three trains. Woo! Nah, 
Yeah, there. That that should work. Also, shouldn't it have unlocked the trains there? Oh, nice. Now it works. And then when that train clears, it should do fine. Well, these cars should be rotating. That section there should unlock the track. Toggle spin. Wait, maybe it... Maybe it disables the spin? Oh, okay, it disables spin. I thought it had to be turned on. Okay. All right, so that'll allow them to spin now. What we could do actually is this. Or is that not going to work? Oh, perfect. All right, let's give it a test. All right. Well, that's why we do tests. need to have the little elevator. I never used that before, so I kind of want to just put it in here just to use it. All well, those cars are spinning awfully fast. Oof. I don't know if they're going to like that. I think that's going to be way too intense. Oh yeah, and that braking? Oof. Well, we'll just we'll have to go with what the numbers say. If it looks rough, but it works, then it works. All right, so car number two is going to stop here. We need a we need a lift to get up that section. So three cars are probably too many. We want two cars at least. Or at most. Three is going to be too many, so we're going to have to go to two trains, two cars. And we could do a block section here. Let's take that out. Because I think if we get rid of this, we'll only be allowed to have two cars anyway. Yep. So we're only allowed to have two cars if we do that. Let's see. Or we could do the opposite, which is like, I think you could do a four and one. Now we can only do, we can only do a two and two. Probably because of the elevator. Okay, let's set up pathways now. And we'll have a ride here and probably here too. I think we could fit something in there. Now the park's getting a little more spread out. But I think our first uh, roller coaster is going to be awesome. Ooh, we can make a tunnel.
pretty substantial tunnel. But what we can do is raise the land and then put a bunch of trees on that. That'll look nice. So we could actually put a ride here, here, and maybe down here somewhere. Not a lot of space for a ride, but we could do maybe a food court. Or we could just fit all the queue in here. The ones from Star Trek. Oh, that's cool. Then we can put a building over this entire thing. Bumper boats in the river? I, that might be a little too small. We, we could make the river a little wider, but I'm not, not exactly sure. But we'll see. Does anyone here play Space Engineers, by the way? I've been wanting to play some Space Engineers, and I need some people to play with. They had some, some updates recently, and I wanted to go back and try out some of the new stuff. Does anyone play? I know Uthris does. Or had. In the past. What's up, Brad? How you doing? You playing? Okay. I'm thinking about doing like a Space Engineer stream at some point. I haven't had a lot of time with all these other games, but it's it's on my list of things to do. Which seems to get longer than it gets shorter. Anybody else agree? Your to-do list only gets longer, not shorter. Even though you do what's on the to-do, it's like never, never to be done. Oh, this looks cool. Then what we could do is actually uh, build a ride here. We can square up a little bit of this territory. Try to make this not a... Oh yeah, this song's called uh, Germany's National Anthem. <laughs> oh, if, we, if we build a tunnel here, it actually would uh, probably increase the rating of the ride. But it probably would do the same as if we put, uh, put trees here. Oh, this looks great. There's a potential here, folks. We got potential. Well, it does keep you busy. That's true. I'd rather be busy than be... Not busy. better. Oh, that looks much better. Okay. I do like the tunnel that goes over here, although it's kind of separated from the whole map. If I could, I would put a pathway over here, but unfortunately we just can't. That's all right, though. This will kind of be part of one big little area for the coaster. I hope the coaster actually is good. I'll have to give it a test and see what its rating is. Uh, let's decorate and then we'll test the rating. Actually, you know what? Probably test it now because if it sucks, we're going to have to fix that. We are losing money. We gotta get more people in the park. And we should probably charge, what, 10, 10 bucks for this thing? 12, 10, 10, we'll do 10.
We could probably take those... Gr oh, man, that thing is going way too fast, man. OSHA inspectors are at the office asking for me. Uh, that's what. See, that's why I have this injection seat installed in the office. But I'll see you guys. Uh, I'll see you guys a little bit later. Okay. Unlike you guys, I gotta go. Bye. Wait, did someone in chat have pizza rolls? Oh damn it! Ah, oh, they got me. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, so much for that. I thought I could escape, but no. I think this ride's going to be way too intense. It's way too fast. Raptor has wings. Oh, are they buffalo wings? Ooh, it's a vi- What? Only medium intensity, and it's a very high excitement? Wow. If we get that up to 70... If we actually get this ride up to 70... Um... It'll actually, like, be a very high-rated ride. Wow. That's an accidental... I mean, um... Yes, all according to plan with my... Skill and, uh, foresight into... All matters and all things coaster of roller. Of course. Chat, you never had your doubts, did you? Me neither. Nice. Look at that fence freaking out. There we go. Alright, so all we gotta do is build like a cool station for it, and it'll probably increase its rating even higher. Definitely want to plant more trees than we're destroying, too. And this coaster should be connected, so people... Oh, it's not. The fence is in the way. Okay, now it's officially open. Come on over. Yay. Alright, so now the ride is open. Uh, let's build a station. What's the rating now? Decoration is low, so we'll make some improvements to that. Mini tra uh, train along the river. I'd like to do that, but I, it's going to take a lot of money. And we got we got to get cash first. And the only way I know how to do that is roller coasters. We need to build a nice little. Uh, maybe we can make this look like a... Oh, what would be a good name for this coaster, by the way? It's really fast. It spins. It has an elevator. What, what's a cool name for this coaster? It's got to be related to, like, uh, logging or, like, a, a lumber mill. We call it, like, Ripsaw. What's a good one? The, the Holy Pinto. N nuggets, yeah. We'll call it Nuggets the ride. We gotta make it look like a sawmill. Spinning logs, okay. Gavin, you want us to name it after your mom? Does she spin on logs too? Paul Bunyan's Revenge. Revenge at what? What happened? What's the story behind that one? Sawblade? Okay. I saw what you did there, Mill. Okay. Against the Grain. Wow. Oh, we're doing research, too. What, what else did we research? Oh, Swinging Ship's coming up next. That's going to be an easy one. Log Roll. Nice. That's a good one. Swinging Ship just unlocked. That's perfect for that space.
Uh, I like the idea of Ripsaw, but... Call it the Beyblade. Oh, you know what's really cool is we could actually disguise the elevator as something. We could, we could build a whole thing around the elevator. We could call it Stock Market the Ride. Vertigo, yeah. I'm still going with Ripsaw. That sounds pretty sweet. If someone could top Ripsaw... Uh, the elevator could be disguised as a clock tower. Why, is it Halloween? Does it need a costume? It should probably go to Spirit Halloween. For all of its Halloween needs. Yes, this is a sponsored stream now. Command of a Spirit Spirit Halloween sponsored a stream. Oh damn, I'd love to do that. If any if anybody from Spirit Halloween is watching, please contact me. Let's do business. Just for the meme. Oh, we we could call this run of the mill. We call it run of the run of the mill. A mi miter joint. You want me to call it a miter joint? Okay. We could we can call it Bob Vila's this old house the experience. It's brought to you by Sprint. <laughs> God. Nobody ever call. By the way, corporation, stop it. Stop naming stadiums and stuff. No one ever wants to call it that cringe name. Sprint Stadium. No. I mean that. Okay. Sprint Stadium actually sounds cool, but no one wants to call it like. Dunkin' Donuts presents Coca-Cola, the public gathering area for sports. Nobody wants to call it that. Stop. Call, give give things cool names. Stop with the Miller, Miller Genuine Draft presents the ride, the fun. I think it's horrible. Could we call it the Miter Damn Near Kilder song? Oh, that looks sweet. Actually, we should uh, do it every other window. Let's do window at the top, no window. And then no window. And maybe we could put a window here. The clock tower idea is cool. That reminds me of that... Uh, What's that movie called? Or the, the ride called? Hollywood T Tower of Terror or something? Uh-oh. My bad. Uh-oh. I deleted something down there. What did I delete down there? Was that a tree? I deleted something down by the ticket booth. should use the longer walls for this but too lazy to go back into the menu imagine being that lazy I deleted a section of wood fence okay oh you're right Good job, chat. Okay. I like, keep, I like keeping everything this theme. It's cool. Oh, that looks neat. Wow, how, how unexpected that this got so cool.
Wow. That looks sweet. You want me to show the objectives? Sure. The objectives are basically there are one, two, three, four, five, and then 600 uh, people in the in the park. Right now, I think we're at uh, we got to earn 300 guests. That's going to happen in no time. Actually, it looks like the park expanded again down here, or it had already. We're going to build a coaster down there too. Log jam. Oh, dude, that's sweet. That's a good one. What corporate sponsorship are we going to get for that? Uh, isn't there a, isn't there a syrup brand that's called like Log Cabin or something? Lincoln Logs presents. Oh, this start. This is starting to look good already. Twisted tree line. Damn. You guys come up with such good names. The problem with chat is sometimes you guys are too good where it's like, we can only choose one name. Like we can only name it one thing at a time. And chat's got some good ones. How, how's the decoration now? It went from uh, low to medium, wow. But the ride went from 61 to 64. Ooh, there's lots of people in line now. The line is getting longer. I feel like we could put some stuff over here, like, um... Maybe we could put some, um... Like, shops or something over here? Oh, well, we could probably at least do a vending machine. It's a little bit of a walk to get over here, so park benches would be nice. And a trash can. Okay, any go-karts? Not at the moment, but if we unlock those, I will definitely put one of those down. Uh, looks like we are working on something called the power surge now. I love how this game limits you with space. Like I, I really like that. Like this mission is purposely meant to be small, which is nice. Planet Coaster is great too. They're both wonderfully fantastic games. Like they're both the best. I think there could be two number. Like when you're so good, there's sometimes there's got to be two number ones. Sometimes things are so good that it's like you just can't choose, right? Yeah, Planet Coaster is an extremely long game, too. Like, it takes a very long time to play that. So this game's good if, like, you've got limited time. I don't know. Both, both give you that satisfaction at the end of the day. I love it. Like, I don't think by saying that this game is amazing is saying that Planet Coaster is bad in any way. No, no possible way. Both are great. They're so good that they're both winners. Music's weird. Why is it so sad?
Yeah, the problem with both these games, too, by the way, is that you're, you're never done. You're never done building. Oh, what if we put text up here? What I like about Ripsaw is that actually three three letters for each word. Looks good. Looks like a lumber mill kind of, yeah. The columns maybe are a little too much. These columns here don't quite fit in, honestly. But we can keep fooling around with it and changing it. Yeah, I don't see any blades as deco. I don't, yeah, no circular saw or anything? That's okay. We can try to make something. Actually, what we could probably do is make something out of triangles. I, I think there is a way to make a saw blade. We, we can make it look like one somehow. Let's put another tree down here then. Oh, that's cool. Okay, we have 286 people in the park. We need to put another ride in. The swinging ship would be perfect down along the coastline. Yeah, a lot of people are saying that streams are buffering. It uh, seems to be on YouTube for... Uh, the answer is always YouTube. The problem, with, the problem with YouTube problems is that when you tell them about a problem, they don't acknowledge the problem for a while. Then they fix the problem, and then a week after the problem's been fixed, then they say, oh, hey, there was a problem, and we fixed the problem. But there was no problem. Problem solved. I mean, that's that's YouTube. It's like, gee, thanks, YouTube. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> yeah, we're going to build something down here. All right, so yeah, I definitely would change a few things about this sawmill, but you know what? It's a sweet idea, and it's a good placeholder. Or maybe something like that looks better. Matches the doorways and stuff. Ah, uh, we could toy around with it. Anyway, let's not spend all of our time on decorating this, because we won't have time for everything. Although this is this is good. This is like maybe this is like 85% complete. Feel like something dramatic's coming up. Yeah, this is a mission briefing for uh Mass Effect. 
Alright, we're gonna add another coaster. Swinging ship, we could put like... Like somehow right here. Very close to being out of money though. We could put it on the other side. Build a bridge across, but I think we should save for another coaster. I need another ride though. Uh, right now they're finishing up something called Power Surge. I think that's a... Uh, I don't think that... I need a ride, like a power launch ride that goes just straight up and down. That would be... That'd probably be the best thing we could get. Damn, that ride's cool. <laughs> Riding the spinners. Maybe some ivy? Oh yeah, we can, we can continue to decorate forever. Like, there's, there's no end to these games. Even if you beat the mission, once you beat it, you can always, like, continue to play it. Sandbox mode. I guess that's good enough for now. Wow. Man, that spinning coaster turned out wonderful. So it went from 61 to 65. Wow. With medium intensity, which people seem to like quite a bit. Which explains the line. Oop. And sorry to everybody losing their head and being decapitated inside the... Uh, entryway there. Oops. Looks like, looks like they bumped their head on the way in. Oops, my bad. It's actually really cool that this has like a holding break here because then it, like, it lets everybody kind of finish spinning around and they don't really spin too much. Alright, watch everybody lose their heads on the way in. Oops. <laughs> They're fine. That'll buff out the ride. Okay. What did we just unlock? We're still finishing up power surge. I need to use I need to use the singing swinging ship though. Oh, we could build it over here. Oh, we could build it over there. I think what we should do though is maybe build on this side of the park. Build it over here. But I think we should probably save that space for a roller coaster because that'd be perfect for a station. Okay, they finished up research on Power Surge, which is... Oh, it's a weird... Uh, oh, it doesn't really have a lot of people. It doesn't really hold a lot of people. Uh-oh. Oh, it is good shape for this, though, but not, not, not great. Not great. Well, we could research a roller coaster too, but I don't know if we're going to get anything to fit in the space other than the, the monorail coaster. A post about Top Scan on social media went viral. Wonderful. Just a little off the top. Yeah, we could we could name the coaster that for sure. All right, let's build another coaster. That brings in more people. Oh, we only got 2,000 though. That's not going to bring in a lot of money. Satan's Fun Park. Oh, is he sponsoring the event? Wow, all these rides are just completely full. Hopefully people get over to the other coaster. <laughs> this coaster is so cool. That corner right there. That whips them. Right here, too. But they like it. They like it, so it's like, okay. Alright, where could we put the monorail coaster? I really want... I really want to put a ride under here. Well, we, we could put this over here. The, uh, what is it now? Power Surge? We could put Power Surge here. Actually, that might be pretty sweet. But if we build up against the back... Oh, 
All right, let's let's build out this section of the park now. We'll build a little wooden bridge. Sponsored by Liability. We gotta get an insurance company to sponsor us. That wouldn't be profitable. Alright, we'll leave that fence there on purpose. Hmm. We got a, f a little bit more space here for stuff. Maybe more decorations. Uh, if anything, when in doubt, just decorate it out because it gives you so much more bonus. All the rides can all get bonuses for being decorated. Oh, that built on the... That built on the hill. Uh-oh. That's all right. Build our entrance here. And our exit here. Ah, <laughs> that's cool. Now we have a walk along the shore. Okay. Sponsored by IHOP, yeah. Oh yeah, that would that would work with all the syrup from all the trees. Good plan, chat. I still want this to be... I think this could be wood. There we go. Alright, then we'll bring this pathway back. Okay, so decorations around all this stuff, and then we can do a roller coaster up here. And we need to get to 300 people, so we're pretty close. Flat rides are pretty easy to put down. I forgot to build this as a queue. My bad. this up that's been my favorite scenario so far really cool Try, I'm going to try a different thing on the ground. Let's try... Oh, this would give... Oh, that's cool. Okay, we still got to put some stuff down here. You just like the video? Thank you, Luca. It's very nice of you. Appreciate the support. Okay, well, we only have $600 left, so... Good takeout alone. I think a $5,000 loan would probably be good. Okay, let's try to uh, build a monorail coaster now. I would do this swinging ship, but... Uh, coasters really bring in people, like crazily.
So we'll have two new rides for people to go on. There we go. Hmm. Yeah, it's a monorail, that's for sure. You'll have to get this pathway out of the way. We'll put the uh, bend over here. Okay. That turn's going to be too much. You think the monorail's going to put our town on the map? I hope so. Like North Haverbrook? This is cool. That's too much of a turn, but we can try this. All those supports, though. That's support from hell. The hell is going on here? Wow, that's that's death. That's a death roll. This we may as well name this one the Gator. With these death rolls like this, my goodness. Wow. We're gonna put a frickin' loop on our monorail coaster. it. Oh boy. Um, I think we make the car a little longer. That might, it actually might be able to go over that if we can make the car a little longer.
It might work. Make the train longer, it might have enough push to get through there. Trying to survive the park rides? Is that what this song's about? Oh, I see how it is, chat. You just don't have any faith. Oh boy, that barely makes it. It's actually pretty sweet. I'm gonna keep it. <laughs> wow, this this one's called uh, this one's called uh, obvious risk. Yeah, that's got all the hang time. Damn. I wonder if I can actually go through the loop. You think we can actually get wow. through? Yeah, I know. Thank you, Owen Wilson. Ladies and gentlemen, celebrity guest Owen Wilson. Dude, what if? Wait, what if we did a uh, interlocking, interlocking loops? Oh, it it could happen. Wow, I could, dude. This is cool. Oh, bro. This is going to be amazing. Oh, chat. One's in chat if you'd ride this. Not a big coaster, but damn, is it sweet. Don't lie, chat. You know this is amazing. You know this is cool. Oh, I love these coasters. This this park is amazing. This little park has turned out to be awesome. What's up, Two Play? How you doing? Yes. One hell, one hell of a uh, long coaster here. Oh, is this go only going down? Oh, it, it has to level out. That's alright, we'll use some of the space over here. Is there a helix down? Oh, yeah. Hmm... We gotta go down to two. Oh, this might actually work. Oh, you know what we could do? Hold on. Wow, we could try to do a du double... No, that's not gonna work. Seems like it'd be easier to do this. Oh boy, this coaster is sweet, dude. Look at all that space it uses. The hell of a use of space. That turn is gonna be tight, though. Also, it's gotta go down to two. So if we go down to two and a fourth, we can level off it. Oh no, it's gonna go too far. Unless. Oh no, we're good. Ooh, that's going way too fast. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> that's too much. Oh, you want me to do a, a log roll? We could try that. Actually, does it have the capability of doing that? Oh, it does. Oh yeah. Uh, uh, maybe. I don't know if it could actually do a roll like that. Let me check real quick. Well, if, there, if we're going to put a break there, we can't. 
We can't do a can't do a crazy move there. We're gonna do a section break. It's gonna have to basically limp back to the station. Bom, bom. You're having authentic ramen right now? Oh, bro. I might need to go out. If, if I go out for ramen, I'm going to have to show chat pictures. I've also been craving, like, South American, and uh, it's been a while since I've actually gone out to, like, a nice restaurant, except for when I was in San Diego, and that was really nice. That was, like, some top-tier Mexican food. Wow, is that really... Well, okay. I th I think if we put in our block break, that's going to auto stop there. We're gonna we're gonna have to block that section into a separate part. That looks like it's going too fast, but I think we might be able to fix that. I'll just bear with me for a second. We might be able to do something. Also, we should probably try to er earn money from photos or something. Oh, you can put a photo section anywhere. Put a photo section there. We'll just mount it onto this support beam. There we go. Alright, where were we? So our track goes... Uh-oh. Oh yeah, we're coming out. Okay. What are you, Advil, ma'am? Lady says she can take our pain away. Must be like... Some, there's something going on with this lady. Okay, so we can do two trains. Alright, let's see how this works in test. Oh, we also have to build stations. Oh boy, oh boy. Raptor, I feel invited to my restaurant if you ever make a mistake and land in Poland. Oh, dude. Going to Poland would be no mistake. I'd love to go. I'm half, uh, mostly Polish myself, so I, I like pierogies and kielbasa, all sorts of good goody goods. Make mo, make no mistake, that is no mistake. Oh, I love our coaster here. This is great. All right, let's give it a test. Wow, very high excitement again. 63.4 with a medium intensity. Not bad. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. That, oh, that, oh, oh, whoa, 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 <laughs> whoa. Okay, we're going to have to use that as a trim brake. Trim brake's going to have to trim. Go down to uh, at least 20. Dear God. That was a brutal neck breaker. Jeez. You didn't see that, chat. That's perfectly normal, perfectly safe. I like the colors on this one. Ketchup and mustard. McDonald's, the ride. This is your heart on McDonald's. Do we go through the loop, dude? That's not bad. I think we could probably manage to make that maybe tw maybe maybe 15. Yeah, I'll definitely go to Poland. It's on my it's on my list. I must. I think we have ourselves a ride, ladies and gentlemen. That scores as highly as the uh spinning coaster so we went double train so we can have a higher throughput which means we can get more people on the ride that's why I'm building those little brake sections because that that allows us to kind of split the ride into two sections which tells the game to like or well I guess it basically in a computer system it would tell it to like send the send the next car so it's safe to send more up Dude, this monorail is a fantastic use of space oh we've already unlocked our third this section up here just opened up. Oh my goodness. Wow. 
Oh boy. Um, well, now we can turn this into a. Oh, we can we can move the exit to this ride to the back, and we can just build a pathway up here. Now we can build another coaster. I don't know what we would build here though. Oh, we, we're gonna have to do another coaster. We we got to do another coaster. We have to. Although the mini coaster is really a, a mini coaster is a big pain in the ass. It's so you can't do anything with it. It's like, hey, are you trying to make a a, a hill? Yes, no, only down. The mini coaster is it only goes down both ways, down and then and then down and and then more down. Down, do ba do down down, da ba da ba down, do ba do down down. All right, we'll make an exit for this ride here. So now, uh, maybe we could research a roller coaster. Uh, what are we researching now? A launch drop tower. Oh, there we go. Yeah. I will take that. That saves so much space. Dude, here's what we're going to do. We're going to put the launch tower in here. We're going to have like a little, we're going to make a little volcano. We'll make a tunnel and then the launch tower will come out of this, out of this. That's going to be awesome. <laughs> Yeah, that's the de welcome to the death monorail. Oh, we need a name for that. What what are we gonna call the monorail? Did we come up with a name? F free death. We could call it free death. Wow, that loop though is so damn. That is risk. But going back through it, dude, is sweet. Mediocre monorail. What? This is awesome. We gotta give it a good name. Also, I don't want to make it look like a sawmill anymore. I gotta come up with a different theme, too. Although I do like how the sawmill is made of wood and the other buildings are kind of different materials. Single bypass, chat's revenge, whiplash. Wow. We call this like Spicy Dream, sponsored by Tabasco. We're knocking out these goals really quickly. The next goal is to get to 400 people, and we're already there. And now the map will probably expand again. And it just did. Oh, now we can build up here. Ooh, maybe we could do our drop tower over here instead. We got... All right, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to have to make an underground uh, pathway somewhere. So people can get over here. Or I could just redesign... I, okay, here's what we'll do. We'll redesign this queue to come over here, and then this will be a pathway through, and then it'll be a, there'll be a loop here on both sides of the river. Wow. We're, we're already on our way to 600. We, we might already beat this before we even have a chance to build all the rides. The, begin, the entrance of our park is so sweet that we don't... Well, let, let's sit back and make money for a little while. The Sriracha? Oh, damn. I like that. There's not going to be a long line at this ride either because there's two cars and it's loading up with people pretty quickly. I think 24 people can be on this ride at a time. Oh, now it's gone up to extreme. Extreme excitement. Wow, it's the best park ride in the park. So if 24 people can ride it at a time... Wow. Yeah, the new the new coaster should have a new ticket price. I ch I'm charging. Uh, did I say ten? I meant twelve dollars and one cent. There we go. <laughs> I don't know what to call it yet, but we'll see. All right. Well, now now that we're about to, we're, we might actually win. I'm I'm gonna sit back for a minute. We need to get some cash so we can build a new ride, like that drop tower. We're researching that. I want to speed up that research, actually. Let's go ahead and double. Let's go 500. Increase that budget. 
I'm not even going to be able to build a station for it. It's going to be over too quickly. Let me get these... Um, I like these archways, though. These poles. Don't know what we can call this thing. We could just call it something simple like hang time. Air time. The death Skeeto. Wow. Well, coming from a corporate stance, I don't think we want to call it anything called like pain, death, destruction. Anything that we could be sued for. We certainly we certainly want to avoid that. This is so cool, though. I love this. <laughs> oh, I love our little park. I should probably take a screenshot of this before we win. Wow. I know. We could call this like cease and desist sponsored by Nintendo. What's up, Beast Gamer? Thanks for the two, dude. Appreciate that support. Hey, guys, uh, by the way, there's going to be a giveaway, like, already at the end of the stream. Like, I know we usually do giveaways only when we hit our member goal, but I have a bunch of keys for some stuff to give away at the end of the stream. So if you haven't yet become a member, right now might be a good time to smash join. If, if you've been waiting on it, now's a good time. And hop on that Discord afterwards for a giveaway. I won't forget, too. I'm doing it right after. So jump on that Discord, y'all. I have no idea what the station is going to be. I, I don't know what I'm doing. Is, it, is that obvious? Is that obvious? I don't I don't know what it is, but it looks it looks nice. You're already on the Discord. Good. Yeah. That's one of the perks here on this channel. For supporting me, I give a lot back to you. At least that's my plan. I want that I want that little archway. Isn't there like a small little bend? Ms. Lena, thank you very much for becoming a Raptor Hatchling. That's very nice. Yeah, this is what I want. Welcome aboard, nice to have your support. It's actually looking more Aztec. I don't know why. More people are still coming to the park. Jeez, I think we could, like, if we build one more ride in an advertising campaign, be all over. Not, not a single, not a single person doesn't want to come to this park. It's awesome. People are loving this place. That's cool. Yeah, you guys can follow on Instagram and Twitter, too. I think I might drop a key on Twitter as well. I, I'm, I'm never sure what the best place to do it is, but just, just follow me everywhere. I only have so many keys, and I want everybody to get a chance, so... Instagram down below. Twitter down below. Discord down below. I'm so proud of that. And that's only going to get better when I add trees now. What a great little ride that is.
Oh, we'll have to put some more rocks and stuff up here as well. So as soon as this research is done, oh, it looks like it just finished. Okay. I'm going to close this ride after we put in the, the tower. We've got to figure out how wide the tower is going to be. So that thing's a three by three. We'll just drop it into the middle. Actually, I think we'll have to do a four by four because the station's on either side. Is that up one, two? Yeah, that looks about right. Now the stations. I was down one too many. That's all right. You can already see it too much anyway. You want me to call it El Diablo? That looks cool. All right, now we got to move this ride around, unfortunately. Making a lot of money, so I hate to shut it down for now, but got to move it. coming down from the top. All right, back in business. Now what we can do is probably hide this thing with a bunch of rocks. We can just put a bunch of boulders and some fog emitters, make it look like it's coming out of the steam. That's pretty cool, actually. Wow, we're not even going to be able to use all the space. We're too, we're too good. What are we going to charge for this thing? Let's charge eight bucks. Eruption. Good one. Good one. All right, let's throw some rocks around that. We can just make the rim of the thing here with a few rocks. Alright, so if we detail that, it's just going to be a bunch of rocks going all the way down. We're close to finishing this up. I think... Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to save here. Timber... Uh-oh, Timber Creek 2.
And that way, if I ever want to come back, I can detail it beforehand. Oh, we need to open this right too? Yep. Good reminder, thank you. Bum, 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 bum. Raptor's Revenge. Hmm. Let's see, we'll call this one... Ah, uh, boy. Parachute? Uh, hmm. I don't know. <laughs> the lawsuit. Plunger's Delight. Ah, oh, that's great, the plunge. There we go. Or we could just call it plunge. Alpine plunge, tree trot, tree, tree top, hop, tree top hop. That sounds more like a kid's ride. But it kind of rhymes, so let's go with it. Okay, let's do signs. You know what I forgot too is that you can actually change the textile as well. Like I forgot that for the sawmill we could actually change the... Oh, that looks cool. Let's change the, uh, the text of the other ride to that one. Ripsaw. This looks too childish. Oh, that's too fantasy. Eh, that's too... Whatever that is, it's too much of that. Oh, that looks like the 70s. What the hell? I like this one. It's a little big, though. Let's put that on the side. Oh, ooh, if we put it on the side. Oh, right there, chat, right there. That's it. We can change the colors and stuff too, but we'll just we'll just put it down as a placeholder. Like we we like it, right? All right, so now we just got to get to 600 guests. We need to we need to rename Ripsaw. Give it a different text style. We should get some rips in chat for rips off. Well, that's a good... Oh, that's good. I like that one. Or... Nah, that looks a little too... No. Uh, not that one either. I think I like, I think I like that one the most. That one looks like, um, like like old west. Now we can replace the supports though. We can move the supports around and try to do something like that. We can also change the colors, but Ooh, wow, look at that rain. Ah, <laughs> look at that. All the lights. Okay, so the only thing we're missing from the other side of the park is a bunch of lights, benches, trash cans, and maybe another food court, which we could probably put out on this little peninsula here. We'll do, like, a, another food court all the way down here, and another toilet, and, uh... Oh, do people not want to ride this? Oh, they don't want to go on it because it's raining. Oh, people don't want to pay eight bucks? Really? Okay. We'll do five. Hey, Booster. All right, so we're just missing a lot a lot of... Um, just missing a lot of lights, I think, but that's not something we need. The treetop hop looks cool. Ripsaw looks pretty sweet. Put some more 
support beams down for the name. Ooh, it actually kind of, kind of like touches it. Uh oh. Any elevators built yet? Yeah. This roller coaster actually goes on an elevator. So it goes inside this little building here and then drops out the top. Look, you can see the coaster being slid onto the elevator there. And then the elevator comes up. And boom. There you go. This place got something for everybody. All right, we need to show a little love to our launcher and a little love to our uh, park paths. But dude, now 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 it's just becoming too big. Now now it's like, oh, don't, I don't need all this space. This is too much. We're on the last part of the operation, which is finishing up, uh, getting up to 600 park guests, and I th I think we could do it with one well placed advertisement campaign. I think we're gonna do it now. One of my trim pieces is on the track. Uh, which track? Which coaster? Ripsaw? Wait, what? Oh, this? Oh, th yeah, this is a break. Is is that what you meant? That That's a breaking uh, thingy. If that's what you meant. Good call, though. It's a tiny little thing to see. Alright, let's do an advertising campaign and get done. Even though we're not really done with this park, I want to I want to continue on with the Oh, what's that lightning? Wow. We're far from done here. Food court here, decorations here, maybe another small Wow, that almost killed somebody. That lightning struck right there. And then we could probably build something up here. I'd probably like to go for another coaster, but aside from a junior coaster, I don't know what else we could fit in there. I'm so proud of the monorail coaster. We did we did such a good job. All right, boys, let's finish this off with one, one park advertisement. Once everybody knows how cool our park is, we'll be trillionaires. You hear me? Trillionaires. Oh, yeah, I think there is a hanging... I think... I don't know if the game has that. Hanging monorail, is that a thing? All right, everybody, grab the popcorn. There's about to be a celebration. While we wait, I'm going to take pictures because it's pretty. Wait, isn't there a photo mode? What's the... Uh... Oh, yeah, X is the photo mode. Try to get a picture of people coming out of the sawmill. Here they go. I'm so proud of the little mon little monorail. We got to get them going over the loop. No, not the rain. 
Damn it, the game is making things difficult. That's going to just make more people not be happy with the park because they can't go on rides for a little while. We're almost there, folks. We just got to hold. Well, while we're waiting, let's add some decorations and move things around. put another vending machine around here, but... Wow, the vending machines proved to be really popular. Yeah, I feel like we should probably put some vending machines up here, too, because this area of the park's pretty, pretty busy, but there's only one way to get into that ride there. It's a little scrunched. Alright, weather's improving, so we should be fine now, boys. You love the videos? Well, thank you very much, Joe. Thank you for being a part of our community. It's the best one. I'll paint the rest of the pathway. I'd go here. Certainly not a big park, but 600 people here, that's quite a few. Yeah, Rob, it's nice to have everybody. We have ourselves a great community. Oh yeah, there, there's so much more space to fit stuff here, it's crazy. Now I just want to hit the goal because it's like we're so close. But there's definitely one I'd continue sandbox until like every block is filled with a tree or a bush or a pathway or a roller coaster or has some sort of purpose and has been considered as like possibly being utilized. like we could probably use some of this territory. I really want more vending machines. Maybe let's scoot this tree over. We'll turn this into a vending machine. Good to go. Bum, 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 bum. Another vending machine. It's pretty cool, man. It just takes one one little spot to fill in. It's just a simple little one square thing without having to build a whole infrastructure. It's certainly not as satisfying, but if people want like a water or some chips or cookies or something, they can probably get them out of there. Well, Company Heroes 2 is an excellent game. Oh, that's true.
Alright, chat. In a few minutes, I want to release a secret video for all of you guys. Looks like we're about to hit our goal, so we'll celebrate by releasing a new video, and I'll let you guys be amongst the first to, uh, to see it. If you like building games, this one is somewhat of a city builder, where instead of building a city by laying out the roads and stuff, you're actually building a power grid. It looks like we're almost there. While this is getting ready, I'm going to prepare our video for release. We just got to get 600 people in here. Got to get those numbers up. These are rookie numbers. Yep, I'm, rele I'm releasing our PM video. It's going to be awesome. What's wrong with the vending machines? Oh, it just needs to be restocked by an uh, employee. Once you build it, any anything you build has to be restocked by a, uh, a member of your staff. Let's see. Oh, we're getting there. That bar is filling up. Does it have Picari Sweat? Sarah, we got to hang out. If you know about Picari Sweat, then you're you're in. You, me, Uthris, Pinto. Oh, wait, who does? I think Elmox maybe, but I don't know if he likes Picari Sweat. If you know about if you know about the sweat, then you're in. That's the Cool Kids Club right there. You're part of the part of the OGs. All right, let's see. Uh, I got to figure out. Yep. We just got to keep these people in here. We're just we're just waiting to see if it fills up. It is cool to see the park, the Ferris wheel, and all that stuff going around. I feel like we could fit one more. No, I think two more coasters, but maybe at least one more small one. Uh, you sweat a lot. Does that count? Uh, for you, you you can count that. I'll allow that. Oh boy, let's see. There we go, that'll do. Alright, so you guys know too, by the way, on Steam, there is going to be a ton of games that are going to be released into demo format. I've been taking a huge list and I've been playing some of them today. Which is why I'm going to only be doing like one live stream a day for the next few days because it's just going to be too much otherwise. So there's like, I've already got like 12 games that I can't wait to show you guys. So make sure you uh, keep an eye out on my channel and on Steam to see if anything you have in your wish list or any, anything you've been wanting to play, check Steam tomorrow and see if it has a demo. Because there's a lot of games coming out that have demos. It's going to be cool. All right. Oh boy, the bar is almost filled. We're getting there. We're almost there, boys. Fill that bar. <laughs> we gotta fill that bar. Oh man. Come on. Oh, we're almost there. We're holding steady at 613. I don't think we're going to lose anybody anytime soon. 
All right, let's see if chat can get up to 500 likes before I get up to 600 guests complete. Good luck, chat. Everybody watching, smash like. Let's go. Let's do it. This has been awesome. This is my favorite park so far, I swear. This is so cool. I love the just cramming everything in. looks so good. Such high detail. It's wonderful. Oh, boy, bo, 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 bo. Oh, we're almost there, chat. You're not going to do it. There's no possible way. No possible way chat's going to get up to the six, the five, before I get to the six. No way. Not going to happen, chat. Don't even try. <laughs> we're almost there. Yay, we did it. Woo. Ah. <sighs> Wow, and we did every uh, optional challenge too. Damn, we get we've got everything, gold star and everything. Woo! Oh, I'm gonna save this one now. We did it. Kimber Creek is done. Awesome. <laughs> oh boy, we did it. All right, I'm gonna release a new video, and you guys can be the first to watch it on the channel. A wonderful little power management game known as green with energy there's the link for it it should be public right about now so go ahead and refresh if it says it's private or whatever and everybody go over to that video and just spam the word popcorn all over that video get over there right now everybody's heading over to watch the new video on the channel power grid building management game and it also has a demo coming to steam tomorrow for everybody because that's when steam's big uh Big little event is from the 16th to the 22nd. You guys have been amazing. Thank you very much for being here. Everybody go over to that new video. Get out of here now. Go over and enjoy the new video on the channel. Love Parkitect. We'll be back to build onto this park a lot more. I like this one too much to give it up. I'll see you guys uh, probably tomorrow then for more live streams. And uh, I will talk to you all very soon. Got to get some videos recorded for you guys. See you next time. Goodbye, everyone. Take care.